Hello friends, welcome back to my channel. It is me, Allie. Today, I have a very exciting video. I don't know about you guys, but I am recently obsessed with watching these holiday gift guides. So I thought that I would do my own rendition of a holiday gift guide. I basically went through all of the items and the products and the things that I have been loving in 2021 and I compiled a list and I will be bringing that list to you here today. I think I have just about 20 items. I'm hoping that I have exactly 20 items because that's like a very nice number to have. I don't wanna have like 21 or 19, I want exactly 20. So the goal is to get 20 items in this video. I will try to link every single item in the description below if you guys are interested in getting any for yourself. Some of these items are like a couple of years old they are just tried and true items that i absolutely love so if i can't find the exact item that i talk about in this video i will try to link a similar one i would also love to know what your favorite thing to get around the holidays is what is your favorite thing to purchase for somebody or your favorite thing to purchase for yourself let me know in the comments below and now without further ado let's just jump right on into this video Number one, starting this video off strong. This is an item that is new to me. It is not new on the market. It's been around, I think, for like close to seven to 10 years now, but it is a new item for me. It is a hair tool accessory, and it is by far my favorite hair tool accessory I've ever used in my entire life. I don't know if you are anything like me, but every time that I go onto Instagram, I see an ad for the Beach Waver probably 20 times a day and I was like you know what let's just do this let's try it out I purchased it and I can confirm I can attest I'm obsessed with this thing it basically has a little clamp right over here and I'll put like a little video in this section over here of me actually styling my hair don't mind the beanie right now i would show you it in all of its glory this hair is probably three or four day old hair at this point and i also have an excessive amount of grays right now like the amount of grays at the root of my head is aggressive right now so we're just wearing a little beanie until i have this baby and then i can dye my hair again but like i was saying i'll put a little video over here of me styling my hair using the beach waver it's an incredible tool basically you just put a section of hair in this clamp, you let it go, and then you press the button either left or right, and it does all the work for you. It makes the most effortless curls, and you can probably do your entire head of hair between 10 to 30 minutes. I have very thick hair, very thick hair. It takes me about 15 minutes to do my whole entire head of hair, and it is just so easy. So again, you have the clamp, you have some options over here to go faster or slower. You have the two options over here to go left or go right, which way you want your curl to go. Over here, you have your power button, and then you also have your plus and your minus sign to make it hotter or to make it cooler. So I'll give you one more quick little overview of what this thing looks like. It also comes in different barrel sizes. I think this is the 1.25, don't quote me on that, I will put it in the description. 10 out of 10 would recommend. I love this thing. I am so excited y'all. I am so excited to be partnering up with Casetify for this next pick in my ultimate gift guide. I have been wanting to work with Casetify for forever so when they reached out to me to partner with them i kind of like screamed inside eternally if you guys are unfamiliar with casetify they are in my personal opinion the best of the best phone cases on the market their quality is unmatched so i'm going to give a little b-roll right now sharing the products that i customized for and then i'm going to talk a little bit more about the brand throughout that b-roll but of course definitely check out the description because i do have a nice little discount code for you and a way to get some little special extras so i'll add that all right into the description below so let's now get into these cases and i can talk highly about these products a little bit more 
Okay, let's talk about this amazing company. Did you know that their cases are made with recycled material? Case Defy's new impact and ultra impact cases are made with 65% recycled and plant-based materials. They're also compatible with 5G and wireless charging. Let's talk about drop protection. If you are anything like me, you drop your phone minimum five times a day. With Case Defy cases, you are equipped with their Tech 2.0 technology that is drop test approved for drops up to nine 9.8 feet. No joke. Case Defy cases are not only here to keep you stylish while using your phone, but they are also here to keep you safe. Case Defy cases are 100% non-toxic and non-hazardous. They also feature an antimicrobial coating that keeps you germ-free, killing 99% of bacteria. How cool is that? They also have endless print options. They come in a ton of designs, so you can pick from your favorite color or print and match your phone to your style or to fit your mood. You can also add your name or a monogram for a truly customizable case experience. So if you are interested in getting a case to buy case for yourself, or gifting one to a loved one, go to casetify.com slash missallycakes to save 15% off of your order. So yes, thank you so much again to Casetify for partnering up with me on today's video and thank you even more to Casetify for creating such high quality, beautiful, gorgeous, aesthetically pleasing phone cases. I am just obsessed. If you guys are interested, again, make sure to check out the description where I have a lot more information about the brand and some discount codes as well. Okay, so next up, I don't really have categories for this video, but these next couple of items definitely fall in the kitchen category, which is my personal favorite category. The first item, y'all, if you don't have one of these, you need one of these. This is my most used kitchen tool. It is the Power Licks Frother. So this is what it looks like. And as I am filming this video, I will put again videos or pictures over here of me using the actual product so you can see exactly how it works. This thing is my happy place. I purchased this maybe three or four months ago, and I think I've used it every single day since I have purchased it. It is just a little handheld frother right over here. You do have to put batteries in the back, but right on the top, you have your on button. You just press it, and the frother does its job. I use this to froth oat milk, so I've recently been very into coffee, which is strange for me. If you have been watching my channel for quite some time, you would know that I hate coffee. When I got pregnant with this second baby, for some reason, I like love coffee now, especially iced coffee, and I really love making like high-end cafe-inspired coffees or espressos or teas at home like chai tea lattes and this thing has come in a clutch. I use this to do all of like my sweet cream foam or my frothed oat milk or my steamed milk. It is the best of the best. It is very, very inexpensive on Amazon as well. And again, you just put it in, froth it, takes about 30 seconds, and then you just pour it over your drink. You can use this for so much more than just coffees and tea as well. And it does come with this really nice stand. So I just put it up and bam, it comes in so many different colors. So we got white because it would match our kitchen a little bit better, but y'all, I love this frother and I'm pretty sure if you follow me on Instagram, you totally understand. You're probably like, girl, we know because I put up so many stories of me like frothing things and then putting it on top of coffee or tea or cocoa. We love. <laughs> To go along with my newly profound coffee, tea, and cocoa obsession, or just drink obsession in general, I have two glasses that I wanna share with you. These are the two glasses that I use the most in my kitchen. This first one is from Libby. It's like one of those beer glass containers that you can use for iced drinks. You can use it, I'm sure, for hot drinks as well. I probably wouldn't use this for a hot drink. I usually use this when I'm making like iced coffees or I'm having like apple cider, anything ice I will put in here. It's just such a pretty glass. So it's supposed to like mimic what a beer glass would look like, but it just looks so, so pretty when you put your drink into it. And it's really nice for entertaining. I've had so many people come over asking me where these glasses are from. So I will link these in the description. I just 
love them and this one is the one that i use the most when i am making hot beverages like coffee or tea or cocoa this is one of those double glass thermal mugs it is so pretty the science behind it i will put a picture over here of what it actually looks like when i put cocoa in it but the science behind it is if you see right here it kind of ends right over there so when you pour your liquid in here it kind of looks like it is being suspended it's so pretty i just love this mug so much and it is really great quality i know that it is dishwasher safe i'm not sure if it is microwave safe i will find that out and be positive about it before i put it in the description but yes these are my two most used glasses in the kitchen hot drinks i always go for this one and cold drinks i always tend to go for this one the next item is another kitchen item. Can you tell that the kitchen is one of my favorite rooms in our entire house? I talk to Adam about this all the time. We have plans to renovate our entire house in like two to three years and I cannot wait to have the kitchen of my dreams. Like that dream kitchen of mine and I always tell him I just want to like live in the kitchen and just become like Martha Stewart and make everything from scratch. I am so excited for that. And this beautiful pan right here is going to assist me in that journey. If you guys have never heard of the always pan from our place, it is epic. It is a little bit of a splurge. So this is an item that you would purchase for somebody if you're like going a little bit more high end or a little pricier. However, there are a ton of sales on their website right now like so so many sales i think you can save like 40 to 50 dollars on some of their items especially this always pan this pan is supposed to replace like seven or eight different kitchen appliances and it is so amazing so this is what it looks like such high quality it comes with a little steamer and it is non-slip it is organic it is better for the environment it is sustainable it is all things good i use this probably two to three times a day from breakfast to lunch to dinner anything that you think that you can do in other appliances you can probably do right in here. So I would highly, highly suggest this pan. This is again, the always pan from our place and it is every bit as good as you think it is going to be. Dun, 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 dun. Another kitchen item. I just, I really love kitchen items and I feel like they are such great gifts to give. Everybody loves kitchen items so the next idea would be a cookbook these are my two favorite cookbooks it is the magnolia table from joanna Gaines. this is volume one and this is a volume two these are the best cookbooks i have ever used in my entire life they are our most used cookbooks we have made so many recipes from both of these volumes and every single recipe that we have made has been better than the last also they're very very aesthetically pleasing we actually have these out on our end coffee table more as like a beautiful little coffee table book so it kind of like doubles as a really awesome cookbook but also some like home decor as well so if i had to suggest any cookbook and anytime anybody asks me family friends on social media like what cookbook i would suggest these are my two go-to's so i will link these in the description you cannot go wrong with these honestly everybody would be so excited to get this let me just give you like a brief little overview i forgot to mention that every single recipe if not mostly every single recipe this is like my list of all the recipes that i want to make and i cross them off as i go Every single recipe, if not most of the recipes in this book, will come with pictures of the actual final product and just chef's kiss. There are no other words. Chef's kiss for these two cookbooks. This next item, I don't have like a tangible product to actually show you in front of the camera because it's more of a DIY gift. But recently, I just put up a video during my advent calendar week to make a DIY advent calendar. So I made two DIY advent calendars. I did one for Lush and I did one for 
bath and body works so I will put like the thumbnail right here and I will also link that video in the description below for inspiration I think one of the most fun gifts that you can give to somebody is a DIY advent calendar give it to them right in the beginning of December you can make it for however many days that you want it to be you can do like one gift per week you can do 12 days of Christmas you can go all out and do all 25 days I will again link that video in the description below I made two of them one was more of like a bath and body Body Works one where I had like candles and lotions and perfumes and hand sanitizers and the other one was a straight-up Lush Cosmetics one where I did I think 12 different products from like bath bombs to hair products to just like all shower and needs it was really really fun but just use that video as inspiration if you want to make your own DIY advent calendar you can make a food one home decor one a book one a candle one the possibilities are endless I have no chill when it comes to these next two items. I feel like one of the best gifts that you can give during the holiday season is the gift of food or drink. It is truly the gift that just keeps on giving. And I have two little food slash drink kits, sets, gift boxes to share with you. The first one, <laughs> be still my heart. First of all, the, the packaging, it is so beautiful. This is the I had to look up how to pronounce this name. I think it's Chew Wow, Chew Wow Chocolate. So this is a chocolate gift box. I love getting me a chocolate gift box around the holidays. Like I said, it is a gift that keeps on giving and most of these items will last for like well over a year. So it's not something that you have to utilize right away. It is something that you can savor and enjoy over months and months and months. I have no problem with the chocolate gift boxes that you can get at drugstores like CBS or Walgreens or Rite Aid or you know any of those type of places you can get like Russell Stover you can get like lint chocolate all of those type of chocolate boxes I have no problem with them chocolate is delicious however I just feel like those are so overplayed I think getting one of these more like artisan type chocolate boxes really just elevates the whole experience and takes it to the next level. This is something that I bought right off of the Chew Wow, if I am pronouncing that correctly, the website. So you get this box full of little mini chocolates, the most perfect snackable size. They have nine different flavors in here. Look at this box. It is so beautiful. I love it. They have nine, I believe nine different flavors in here and one, two, three, four, five of those flavors are their holiday flavors. So I'm going to share with you a couple of them. They have the shaken up s'mores one. Just so beautiful. Exploding coal. If you've never had this chocolate before, it is everything. One of the best chocolates I've ever had. Cookies all the way gingerbread hope joy and gingerbread this is the one i'm the most excited about of course a peppermint chocolate bark and then they also have just like non-seasonal flavors in here as well so you're getting some seasonal flavors and you're also getting just like their regular run-of-the-mill flavors this one is sprinkles this one over here is potato chip get in my belly love me a chocolate covered potato chip this one is a firecracker. I believe it has like popping rocks inside of it, like popping candy. And the last one is honeycomb. So I think you get 36 of them in here. Don't quote me on that one. But I just think that this is such a good gift. Everybody loves getting like those Russell Stover ones or the Lint or the Godiva, but they're just kind of overplayed in my personal opinion. If you just spend a couple of dollars more, you're more apt to have a crowd pleaser gift. So I'm gonna open one up just to show you exactly the size of this one. If this is something that you are interested in, just says devour me, chihuahua. And on the back, you can see like all of those textured pieces that are going to be inside of here. It's such good chocolate. Catch me eating this whole box by the end of December. <laughs> no shame in my game. Oh my god. Delicious. So good. And now it is time for the drink portion of the gift set category. This is from David's Tea. David's Tea is one of my favorite places to get tea on the internet. They have such a wide range of flavors and different products to really up your game in the kitchen when you are making your favorite teas. They have a bunch of different gift sets on their website as well. I bought 
so many of their gift sets and i just love each and every single one of them this one being one of my favorites it is the fall faves so in here you get 12 different canisters of their fall line you get in here apple cider blueberry pancakes cardamom french toast maple syrup oolong mocha chai english toffee peanut butter cup pumpkin chai pumpkin creme brulee that one was so good salted caramel oolong strawberry rhubarb parfait sweet potato pie and I believe that is it. So right on the back, they tell you all about the teas that you are going to be getting. It also tells you like calories. It tells you how to steep it, how much caffeine is inside each of these. And pretty much each of these tins will get you anywhere between one to three cups of tea, depending on how strong you like it. So this is what the canisters look like inside of the little gift box. I've used so many of these so far. However, I only do like one scoop, so I'm really getting my money's worth. As you can see over here with this canister, I think I used this one twice so far, once or twice, and I still have that much left. So like the quality is there, but also the quantity, and these just make such great gifts for anybody in your life who loves tea. Whoa, kind of up close and personal. I have to grab the next two items. The next two items are in my apparel category. Again, I don't really have categories for this video, but these next two items are apparel inspired items. This first one being this sweater that I got from Etsy. I love this sweater so much. So I'm not saying this specific sweater is what you could or should purchase, but I'm thinking of sweatshirts that are kind of fandom sweatshirts. I think one of the best places to get fandom sweatshirts is on Etsy. So whether you have a friend that is obsessed with The Office, Friends, Harry Potter, Disney, Christmas, they have so many talented small shops on Etsy and small creators on Etsy that create such a beautiful work. I bought this one last year for myself. I love it. I've probably worn this 50 times already this season alone and the quality is so, so nice. So my next suggestion is to go to Etsy and look up fandom sweatshirts or sweatshirts in general. I know for like Halloween, I love Halloween. I get so many apparel items on Etsy because a, they're unique. They're not just like regenerated over and over and over again at the department stores. They're really unique, one of a kind of pieces and they're just so nice so cute and they definitely are compliment worthy i get so many compliments on this sweater and everyone's like did you get that at target where did you get that i'm like etsy it's from a small creator which i think is really really awesome this next item i felt obligated to include in this video because i feel like this dress this next apparel item kind of like broke my instagram for a hot minute i have never had so many clicks through a link than when i uploaded the link for this dress right here this dress is from amazon if you know me but at all i love amazon i love amazon so much and this is probably one of the best if not the best clothing item i have ever purchased from amazon look wise quality wise fit wise comfort wise this dress has it all so i can't try it on right now because i'm nine and a half months pregnant and it doesn't it does still fit but it's not something that i want to share with the internet right now this is actually a dress that i wore pre-pregnancy and my first into my second trimester so it is definitely bump friendly i'll give you a quick little overview of what it looks like give you kind of like a sense of the material that you're working with we have this cute little frilly overlap over here the nice puffed out sleeves and then it is just a long dress i will also insert a picture right here and i'll put a video right here of me wearing the dress the first picture i was pregnant but very 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 early in my pregnancy this next picture i was kind of like well into my second trimester so this is again a very bump friendly dress and it's also a perfect dress if you are not pregnant this is actually not even a maternity dress it is just bump friendly I just love this dress so much and it comes in so many different colors. I'm already thinking about like ordering a couple more 
for the spring and summertime and I'm actually thinking because my baby is due December 5th nobody cares but I'm just talking out loud right now baby is due December 5th so I'm thinking of ordering like a deep forest green one or like a deep red one to wear on a Christmas day so this is the next one I again just had to include it because it is one of my favorite dresses and apparently one of your favorite dresses as well next up a home decor item. I would say with home decor items, know your audience. For me personally, I am a huge Disney fan. If you guys follow me for any of my Disney content, you know that I like eat, sleep, and breathe Disney. I just love Disney so much. So this is an example of like a home decor item that somebody could purchase for me that would make me very, very happy. But when it comes to home decor items, all the items are just so universal. The sky is the limit. Know your audience, know what they like, and purchase them something that will really make them smile. I think one of the best places that you can go to purchase home decor items would be Marshalls or TJ Maxx or Home Goods. They have so many nice home decor items there and they are just so reasonable in price. So this is again an example, this cute little peppermint mini mouse wreath. I cannot wait to put this up in my house. It is just so, so beautiful. I got this in a subscription box last year and it just made me so happy it like truly sparked joy to me it was just like filling my heart with magic so this definitely does it for me but again know your audience and pick out something that you know that they're really going to enjoy that they can have in their house whether it is seasonal or whether it's something that they will keep up in their house year round Dun, 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 dun. The next item is one of my most used tech items of ever. It is the UBZ tripod. So this is what the package looks like when it comes to you. It comes in a nice little traveling case, but I will show you what the actual tripod looks like. This one is so inexpensive and the quality is really, really nice. I'm not going to say it's like the best quality tripod that you're going to get, but you get what you pay for. Most tripods out there that are like high quality are upwards of like $100 to $200. I think that this one was under $20 or under $30 and it truly gets the job done. I use this for all of my filming, literally all of my filming i have my camera on like a little tiny makeshift tripod right now to film because i know i wanted to share this but when it comes to filming any of my videos sit down videos clipped videos arts and crafts videos i use this and i also use this for a lot of my photos so i'll just give you a brief overview you can open this up over here open it over there it has three different sections to make it taller right over there depending on how tall you want it to be or depending on like the thing that you are filming or taking a picture of it also has an area over here where you can make it taller like this and then on top of that it also comes with two other things that are really important because most of the time when you get tripods you have to buy these separately so this comes with a little attachment for your phone so you just have this right here you clip this in to the little screw over there you open it up and then you can just place your phone in there and it opens like this and it also comes with a remote control so you can just connect this to your phone or to your camera and if you're like taking pictures of yourself or taking pictures of different subjects you just click it and it takes the photo for you i cannot recommend this anymore again i'm not going to say it's like the most high quality tripod that there is but i will tell you when I was like super, super, super <laughs> into YouTube and I was doing like videos all the time, my husband bought me a tripod and it's like $175, maybe $200 tripod. I almost never use it. I use this all the time because it is just so user friendly. It is so easy to just take with me. My other tripod is so bulky. I love just how like sleek this one is. And again, you just throw it right in this bag, put it over your shoulder and you are good to go. I do have to come a little up close and personal for this next one. Hopefully my pores are all <laughs> covered for this portion of the video. But I would say one of the number one asked about items on Instagram or on YouTube would be this name necklace. So I have this name necklace of my son and it says Landon right on it, L-A-N-D-O-N. It is one of those name necklaces. I also got this from Etsy. I just love getting items from Etsy from like small shops. I just feel like their craft is so, 
so much higher than the regular old department stores like Target or like any of those type of department stores. I wear this every single day and I think that this one was $30. I will put the actual price in the description. It is not tarnished a second and I have accidentally gone in the shower with this plenty of many times. It is just really nice quality. So this one just says Landon. I get questions about this necklace all the time. I had one from Fraser Sterling. My very first one was from Fraser Sterling, but it did end up like rusting and tarnishing really, really bad. And this is my favorite necklace. So I wanted to get another one. I was like, let me try out Etsy. So I tried out Etsy and I am more than impressed with the quality. I am really loving on it. So I will link the exact seller for this one in the description. They have so many different sellers on Etsy that make these name necklaces. You just go in the search engine and say, name necklace and like a billion come up but I will link the specific seller if you like this exact one can you guys hear the vibrations going on in this video I'm hoping that my camera is not picking up the vibrations if it is I'm gonna have to work with like noise reduction while editing because they are doing some major major construction down the street from my house and our whole house is shaking. It is like this all day during the week. I'm actually a teacher and I'm on distance learning right now because we had some COVID cases in our school. So we have like four or five days of distance learning. Again, nobody cares, but I just wanted to explain why if you're hearing like some vibrations in this video, this is what's going on. My first day back to distance learning, I was like, what in the world does that sound? My whole house is shaking right now. Like it's actually, shaking and it's like every 10 seconds it's so annoying so i apologize if there's like a really weird vibration sound in this video i will try very hard when editing later to kind of edit it out but try living with that for like six hours a day it's very very annoying you know what is not very annoying though this next amazon purchase this is another item that is one of my most used amazon purchases of ever this is a portable utensil kit i throw this into my lunchbox and i use this every single work day so i'm gonna open it up for you this is so good for like the sustainable friend in your life if you have somebody in your life who's trying to be like more sustainable this is the most perfect gift to give <laughs> sorry this is what it looks like inside you have that insulated portion inside and then inside you have all the utensils that you would need and they're all reusable so you have your spoon they have a bunch of different colors on amazon as well you have your fork you have your knife, you know, your standard ones, which obviously everybody expects to get a spoon, a knife, and a fork, but then you get more things in here as well. You get chopsticks. I've never seen a portable utensil kit that has chopsticks in it. And then you also have two different kinds of straws. You have a straw that was right yeah, yeah two different kinds of straws. You have this kind of curved straw, and then you also have this straight straw. And then that's not it. There's more. It also comes with a straw cleaner, one of those little brush cleaners. I love this thing. I think it was under 20. I believe it was under 20. I got this over a year ago and I use this every single day. When I'm at work, I just wash them. We have a little sink with our dish detergent. I will wash it down and I am good to go for the next day. This is perfect for traveling purposes, for work purposes, even just for home. And they're really, really pretty utensils as well. So could not recommend this anymore, especially if you have a friend, again, who is trying to be a little bit more sustainable. This is so much better for the environment than those plastic forks and spoons and knives and chopsticks get one of these you will not regret it don't know how i'm doing with 20 items i think i'm gonna hit exactly 20 also don't know how i'm doing with the length of this video what are we at like 30 minutes 40 minutes 50 minutes right now i have a couple more items and then we will wrap up this video the next item being the pura home fragrance diffuser device this is another one of my most favorite items that I have for my home. First of all, it's very aesthetically pleasing and it's a smart home fragrance device. So basically this connects 
to an app on your phone and you can control this device using your app all you have to do for this is just open it up right over here and then you put your little vitals in and they have so many different scents i have in here right now the nest pumpkin chai you can put two vitals in here at one time and you can have them both running at the same time or you can have them going at different times you can set when you want this to go on when you want it to shut off if you want it to run continuously you can use their app to tell you like the scent intensity if you want it to be really strong less strong each one of these vitals will last anywhere from like 15 to 21 days so i have a couple other ones that i have in here that i'm going to be saving for like the holiday this one is pumpkin macchiato so i actually probably should start using this one soon considering i already decorated for christmas but the two that i have for like december january is cranberry fizz and then I also got the one that I'm the most excited about. It is just Nest Holiday. I love the brand Nest. They also partner up with like luxury brands that kind of create different kinds of perfumes. So you know that the scents that you're going to be getting are like top notch. So yeah, once you just put the vital in, you just put this over here, you plug it in and it also has like a little nightlight, which you can also control different colors. It can be like blue, pink. I just keep it on the white setting, but it's very sleek. It is a very, very modern and it is just a lovely, lovely item. I am all sorts of uncomfortable right now. No amount of comfy clothes or nice snuggly pillows will keep me comfortable for these last couple of weeks of pregnancy. So if I'm kind of like moving around a little bit and putting myself in really weird positions for the rest of this video, I'm just very uncomfortable, like very, very uncomfortable. Even laying down is not comfortable. So let's move on to the next gift. I feel like I tried to curate a very, very diverse list of gifts for this ultimate gift guide and this next one is no exception i feel like this next one is kind of out in left field however if you are a gamer you know a gamer you know somebody who loves to play board games you know somebody who likes to host game nights at their house this is the perfect gift for them this is the game of scrabble a crossword game we've all seen the game of scrabble before however this is a vintage bookshelf edition it is like an elevated version of scrabble what i like so much about this is that you can use it obviously as scrabble is meant to be used to play the game but you can also keep it out in your house as kind of like a home decor item it is just so pretty i absolutely love this version and i believe they have a clue one and a monopoly one as well so this is what it looks like it is just so beautiful so inside it is just the game of scrabble however the aesthetic of this one is just top notch i definitely want to get the other ones let me open it up for you it's just so pretty looking so this is definitely something that people can keep out year round it's definitely like a coffee table accent type of game you can use it to play the game or you can just use it to decorate your house as well i'm hoping to get the monopoly and the clue and i want to put this on our bookshelves just kind of like for aesthetic purposes but also we love to play games in this household so this is a perfect game and the perfect gift for somebody who is the gamer in your life i'm checking the items off as i go i think i have three items left to share in this video this next item is very very functional no pun intended it is called function of beauty so if you guys have been following me for any period of time you know that i have been using function of beauty shampoo and conditioner in my hair exclusively for just about two and a half years now my hair has been thriving ever since i started using their hair care products i think that this would make such a good gift for the person in your life who like really likes to take care of their hair and try new hair products so these are the shampoo and conditioners that i just purchased i kind of went for a red and green theme to kind of like match the holiday season if you're unfamiliar with function of beauty it is a fully customizable hair care line so you go onto their website and you fill out a little hair quiz and you 
basically talk about the profile of your hair. I said that mine is wavy, medium, and normal. You talk about the goals that you want to see out of using their products. I said I wanted anti-frizz, deep conditioner, length, shine, and strengthen, and then you can even customize the color and the fragrance. I went with nude peach, and I went with a medium scent, and again, I went with red and green. So it's just such a nice gift to give. These are completely vegan, really great for the environment, and really, really great for your hair. So I can't talk about this company anymore. I might have a code. I will link it in the description if I do. I used to have a code with them. However, it's been many moons since I've like tried to use that code. So if it does still work and it is still active, I will link it. A little pricier but again you get what you pay for you're definitely getting much better ingredients and much better quality items in this shampoo and conditioner than you would if you just purchase a shampoo and conditioner from the drugstore so this is the next item or items on my gift guide I just I love this brand will my camera die before I'm able to share with you the second to last item in this ultimate gift guide. It is flashing red right now and that's when you know you've been talking to a camera for far too long. The second to last item that I wanted to share with you is a journal. Full disclosure, this was sent to me for reviewing purposes. It is from Silk and & Sonder and I just love this journal. I have the November one in the other room, but I wanted to share with you the untouched December version. These are so beautiful, made in the United States, small shop, California. It is made homegrown and is just such a beautiful, beautiful, beautiful journal. I think journaling is one of the most therapeutic things that you could possibly do. And I love how this one is scripted. It tells you like prompts to do and then it also gives you places to take notes. So if you wanted to just like straight up journal, you have a space over here. And then it is also scripted for you to talk about like specific things. It has all of like the days of the week in the month that you are working with. I'm not sure if my camera is even focusing, but it's just a beautiful journal. They have like mood trackers, they have a place to put recipes, a lot of like open space for you just to be creative as possible. Talk about your indulgences. It is just so beautifully curated. I love it so, so much. So if you have somebody in your life that likes journals, this would make an amazing, amazing gift. And last, but definitely not least, the final item in this ultimate gift guide is quite possibly the most overplayed item to gift or to receive around the holidays, but it is also the most practical item to gift or to receive, and it is to give something cozy, whether it be a beanie, a pajama set, a loungewear set, a nice blanket, some fuzzy slippers, anything cozy. It's just such a nice gift to give or to get during the winter months. I feel like you get a lot more than expected during this gift giving season but all of the items are just so practical. I feel like a lot of these items that I talked about are practical in today's video. However, a cozy item is just an item that you know you're going to get use out of. So I would definitely suggest to get like a nice pajama set or loungewear set or robe. This is one of my favorite things to gift to myself is fuzzy slippers. I wear these every single day, as you can see. <laughs> they have been worn to death and they're just it's so cozy i feel like when you kind of like put it all together and you have that comfy little lounge wrist set on you have your beanie you're wrapped up in a blanket and you have on your fuzzy slippers drinking some hot cocoa it is just a straight up mood so although you get a lot of these items and it's probably one of the number one items to gift during the holiday season it's just so practical and it is an item that you know the other person will definitely utilize and get a lot of use out of. And that is it for today's video. Thank you guys so, so much for watching. I really hope that you guys enjoyed and I really hope that you guys kind of feel me on this ultimate gift guide. I hope they're items that are not just appealing to me, but they're items that are appealing to a wide audience as well. So thank you so, so much again for watching and for supporting me here on YouTube. I hope that you guys are all having a beautiful, 
beautiful start to your holiday season. I cannot wait to talk to you guys again soon. Thank you so much again to Casetify for partnering up with me on today's video. It means the world to me and it means the world to me that you guys even allow me to have sponsorships in the first place. Again, I love you to the moon and back. I hope that you're having a beautiful day and I look forward to talking to you all soon. Bye guys.